Okay, so you have your sheet set up now if you've watched the last video, but you want to set up your membership questions. And if you've already done that, you don't need this video, but if you haven't, this is what you're going to want to do. Go to your groups and pick one of the groups. I'm going to use this group maximizer for the examples here. <clears throat> it's one I just started. We've only added two members. We do have a couple of people at least that are waiting to come in. So I'll show you how to do that. But one more step to do first is you want to go to where it says manage here on this screen you go to when you go to your group. Go to manage and you'll see one that says membership questions. Okay. And uh, I think I actually saw a typo here. I want the word cell corrected. There we go. Save. Okay, you want to add questions. If you don't have any questions, you can hit the create. Now, you can only have three. So my create button is gray because I've already added them. <clears throat> so here's the questions I'm asking. Are you a group maximizer registered user? And when you go to do these, you'll have several options. You type your question in. You can do a written answer or multiple choice. For this, I did multiple choice. And I gave them two options, yes, and reminded them we verify emails or no, Sorry for the software users only. They can't join if they're not a software user. <clears throat> and that's just an example, okay? You can have any three questions you want. Um, some people ask for email and phone number. I do ask for email. And again, I've done the same thing. The only difference on this one is I selected the written answer section so they can actually type their email in the box. And the third question I used, <clears throat> I wanted to find out if they want to resell Group Maximizer and keep 100% of the proceeds. So I've asked them yes, no, or maybe would need more information. I want to know that. If they say yes, I'll send them info. If they say maybe, maybe I'll get into a conversation with them. If they say no, I know not to bother them with that. Okay, but you can ask any three questions you want <clears throat> and uh, the information will go out to the sheet that you created. So go ahead and create your membership questions. Uh, minimum, you don't have to have any questions, but if you have one, uh, you can have just one, you can have two, but a maximum of three. Um, you can also create group rules and ask pending members to agree to them. I'm not going to discuss that here. That's kind of irrelevant to this particular uh, discussion. Um, so go ahead and create your questions. And in the next video, we'll look at how to uh, get those questions, uh, the responses to those questions into your Google Sheet after you've approved or declined the members.